crew, time to take off those fat pants. It's Get Fit Friday. Okay, Stu Crew, John based out here. Before we even get started with Get Fit Friday, I've got a little shout out to do. To Stu Crew member, the lovely, the talented, at Rowena April. Rowena, this is a surprise to you because you surprised me. I've been seeing tons of tweets, tons of comments, uh, sharing the YouTube videos, doing everything you can to pimp out New Media Stu, and that means a lot to me. So thank you, thank you, thank you. You are an awesome Stu Crew member. And all your other Stu Crew members, please follow Rowena's example and spread the show. Share the videos uh, amongst all your friends. New Media Stu is like a big hot bowl of joy. Get chumped. And now it's time for part two of my Halloween fitness video that I did when I took that trip to Washington, D.C. And even though All Hallows' Eve may have passed this week, some of that candy booty remains. So now I'm going to give you some fitness-friendly ways that you can enjoy those treats, but still stick to your weight loss goals. Hey guys, I'm John Bastow with some tricks to avoid treats. Now, if you are trying to be the sexy witch this Halloween instead of the dumpy pumpkin, or maybe if you're a guy and trying to be Captain America instead of the Michelin Man, follow these for success. Number one. Now, a lot of times, especially if you're not one of the most visited houses, you're gonna have Halloween candy left over. So when buying candy to set yourself up for success, like we talk about, you wanna buy some candy you don't like. Candy that's not gonna be tempting after Halloween to overeat. Number two, when the kids come back with all their booty, don't let them sit there and eat it all in one night so that they feel sick and miserable afterwards. Remember, candy has an extremely long shelf life. You may have enough candy there for a year. Portion it out. Have a piece or two a day, even if the first day you have more because you're so excited. And then every time your kid has a piece or even you have a piece of that candy, you're gonna remember the fun times of Halloween. It brings back some good memories. And finally, I know this is not a popular choice, but there are healthy alternatives that can be given out for Halloween. There are individual packets of raw nuts or mixed nuts or nuts and raisins that can be mixed in with some of the not so fitness friendly treats so that Halloween can become festive and a little bit more fitness oriented. But anyway, follow those tricks, enjoy your treats, don't lose your waistline in the process. Much love and respect. <laughs>